Sounds like Leslie Hudland, the creator of The Acolyte, is a huge fan of the Clone Wars series. Yes, recently Leslie Hudland talked to IGN and said the following quote, My favorite episode is The Wrong Jedi. I definitely took some inspiration from that. This quote comes right after saying that she is a huge fan of the animated Clone Wars series and that she took some inspiration for the Acolyte from that series, specifically the episode The Wrong Jedi. Now, if you didn't watch The Clone Wars or forget what the episode The Wrong Jedi is about, this is episode 20 of season 5, I believe, and this is when Ahsoka is expelled from the Jedi Order as she is wrongfully framed for a murder. Anakin is kind of searching for the real murderer. He has faith in Ahsoka that it wasn't her, but she kind of is expelled and just leaves the Jedi behind feeling as if she's been lied to, that they can't trust her, and she really has no faith in the Jedi anymore. It's kind of a more intense and serious toned episode, especially for an animated show of the Clone Wars stature where we get a lot of goofy episodes, a lot of droid-centered episodes, but there are some episodes that really shine bright as more mature and heavier, and this is definitely one of them, a huge turning point in Ahsoka's character arc, live action, animated, everything. Now, it's very cool that Leslie Headland is a fan of the Clone Wars. That is some really good Star Wars for her to take note of, especially when going into a fresh time period of Star Wars and kind of putting her own spin on things. But pointing out this episode is very peculiar, but it does make some sense. The Acolyte sounds like it will be kind of this murder mystery type thing. We have this rogue dark side user killing Jedi. At least that's kind of what we've been pitched through the very vague trailers. And it sounds like it's going to be a little more seriously toned. And it makes sense why she would look at this episode as there is kind of this murder investigation going on. People getting wrongfully framed. A lot of different pieces falling together. And a lot of questions being asked. Which if the Acolyte is anything like this and we are going to get this kind of Jedi murder mystery while trying to find the Acolyte, the Jedi at a larger power then this is definitely the right episode for her to look at and take inspiration from. And it also makes me a little more hopeful for the series because if she takes inspiration from one of the best Clone Wars episodes, in my opinion, and kind of emulates that into the live action format in this new time period, then I don't think we can go wrong. I know there are a lot of doubts about this show. I have mine, but I also have my hopes as well. And hearing that she is a fan of the Clone Wars and this episode specifically gave inspiration to the story of the Acolyte, this is one of my hopes. Now, I'm going to keep this quote with me while watching the show and in my review for the episodes once I kind of see that connection to this episode, I will definitely bring it up, so watch out for that because... I'm taking all these things that the directors and producers, writers, actors, everything are saying, and I'm remembering them because it's very wrong when we get wrongfully hyped up. Actors, directors, producers, etc. say all these things and we never get delivered. So I'll be looking for that wrong Jedi episode influence and Headland's work coming up in the Acolyte very soon, about two to three weeks, I want to say. I'm going to be doing reviews on each episode after they drop on the channel, so make sure to look out for those. As far as this news, Leslie Headland being a fan of the Clone Wars and getting inspiration from the episode of The Wrong Jedi, I want to hear what you guys have to say about this in the comments below. I'm excited to hear what you have to say, and while you're at it, make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe to the channel if you are new. Thank you so much for watching, and have a great day.